Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to do a quick look at the Euro Hike Trek Solo Cook Set. Every time I think I'm going to wake up back in the jungle. Every time I think I'm going to wake up back in the jungle. Peter bought this a couple of days ago in millets. And it was reduced from £15 to £10. So we're going to have a look at it and then he's going to get a brew on in it and have a look at it himself and then we'll film that so let's have a look what it says it says it's multifunctional insulated silicon handles hard anodized finish wear and corrosion resistant super lightweight aluminium washed thoroughly before use so he has used it so he has washed it bowl serves bowl serves as a lid it's also you can have it as a small cup you can cook that as a cook pot or it's, it's a cup so it's the euro hike trek solo from millets i think i think euro hike is one of their brands so let's open it up and have a look comes in a handy perforated bag which has got a little pull toggle on it. Now, because he's already used this, the other good thing about it, you'll fit a gas canister in it. So there's the bowl, which is also a small cup. I think it's 250 mil, this one. So that's your bowl, which is a cup. It's 250 mil. I'm not sure on that measurement, but I'll find it out and put it in. Now the, the main cook bowl, once you take the sleeve off it, it's got folding handles that come together, like most of them. You can fit a small gas can in there. I think this is the 100 gram one. Well that'll fit inside the mug, so that's good because it takes up you know less room in your pack if you can put it inside. It's got markings on it for how much fluid you can put in it and they're readable from the inside so if you can see that you can read it from the inside so when you're looking into it as you're pouring into it it's in fluid ounces and in milliliters so we have 16 fluid ounce or 400 milliliters 12 fluid ounce eight 300 milliliters eight ounces or 200 milliliters but looking at the cup, I'd say it'd hold 500 mil, which is half a litre, because that's the limit of the 400, so that would go up to 500. That's a 500 mil cup or bowl, mug, whatever. So let's get it on the stove and get a boil going. The handles are riveted through, as you can see here, into the actual mug itself. He's used it on the gas. He hasn't left any markings on the bottom from using it. The only dirtiness in it is where he hasn't cleaned it properly on the inside. But that's what he did, he didn't buy it like that. Let's get it on the stove and then heat it up and see how it goes. He's just going to boil water for a coffee. But £10 for a set, I mean you can spend a lot more than this. And to be honest, the best time to buy camping equipment is out of season. We're in October now. October reductions. What can you say? Just buy it in the winter, you know it's there for when you need to go and you get bargains as well. So let's go and get it on the stove. Right, get, get it on full blast. Right, we're gonna do a time boil on this. You can see the time. It's quarter past one. So the handles will stick out so they're not in the way. Got a good blast of gas on that. It fits on the stove quite well. It's like a pocket rocket stove, this one. You've got this little bag. You really do need the bag because it helps keep everything together. Because the lid and the pot, aren't, um, they can't click together. So this will just hold it all together. Not a bad little perforated bag. Right, so 
Oh, it says 14 pound on there. You told me it's 15. No, so, it's 15 on the shelf. Yeah, it's 14 on the sticker, so it was 14 originally. Yeah, it was 10. It said 15 on the shelf. Reduced down to 10. Five hundred mil pan, two hundred and fifty bowl lid. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. Looks like we're starting to get a boil on this pot set now. I just saw a bit of steam coming out. Let me have a look. Then lift it off. Got a rolling boil. Take it off, and the time that was in four and a half minutes, five minutes. Not bad, not bad at all. Yeah, I mean, please, I'm pleased with that. For you, it's your set. Yeah, it's good. I want to get a BCB Mark II, and I. So there's the Euro Hike Solo Trek. Trek Solo, sorry. That's a little quick review on that. He hasn't cooked in it yet, but... £10 a millet is why stocks last. You know, it's hard anodized, it's aluminium, it's lightweight. I'll get the um, weight of it, and I'll put that in for you, so you know how much that, was, that actually weighs. But yeah, he's really pleased. Putting his sweeteners in now. Looks like a win, doesn't it, for a tenner? Well, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you want to see more, don't hit, hit, hit the subscribe and the little bell so you don't miss any up and coming ones. Thanks a lot. Bye.